Hey, what's happening guys? Welcome to the frozen wasteland that is Ohio on the first day of February. The snow, she's a coming down. At least the temperature's gone up. It's up to 12 degrees now. So why am I out here? Well, it doesn't really matter. Let's get to the business of the day. Well, I am glad to be inside because it is super cold outside and I don't like super cold. What I do like is electronics and tech and you guys like that too because that's why you come here. So I have got something for you. This is the Raspberry Pi Model B, 3B Plus. 19% more better than the Model B. And this is from a company called Abox. Look at that. Designed by Abox in Toronto, eh? I bet you they got their toques on up there, eh? They know what they're talking about. To my Canadian fans, I apologize, but I had to do it. So this is a complete <laughs> Raspberry Pi setup here. A box Raspberry Pi FBA3. I think this is the comes with the 32. We'll find out. Uh. So to start off with, right, you see on top here is your Raspberry Pi. Uh, this is the 3B plus. So this has got the broadband BCM 2837BO BO Cortex A53 64 bit system on a chip 1.4 gigahertz uh, 2.4 gigahertz 5 gigahertz wireless Wi-Fi <laughs> gigabit over Ethernet or no gigabit Ethernet over USB 2.0 H264 MPEG4 decode uh, 40 pin tube you know it's, it's the newest Raspberry Pi it's very nice but there's more goodies in here. And this is a this is a nice thick box, and this is rather well packed. Yeah, look at this. So up next, we have the power supply, and this is important because pies are a little bit power hungry, so they need a, a five volt supply. This is three thousand milliamp or a three amp power supply, and it's switched very nice this would be your um, HDMI cable here we have the 32 uh, gigabyte micro SD card comes with noobs installed on it if you don't know what noobs is it is basically a like startup operating system that allows you to select the operating system you want and get it going really easy to use Okay, we have a little adapter here. That's really nice for the micro USB. For that goes to a USB Type C. Okay. We have the heat sinks for the uh, APU and the GPU. And that was nice little golden with the Raspberry Pi logo on it. We have a nice uh, clamshell hard case and a little instruction manual. This is a this is a heck of a setup here. Now one of the neat things about this power supply is it is electrically filtered and it says it has enough power to support overclock or external hard drive and it is specially designed for use with the Raspberry Pi 3B+. So this is really, really a super nice setup here. And the price reflects that. This lists for $75. Uh, I'll tell you right up front that I didn't pay for this. A box sent this out for me to do this little review for you guys. <clears throat> but that's not all I'm going to do. What else I'm going to do is I'm going to pack this back up. And I'm going to send it to you, or you, maybe you, could be you. No, that's me. I don't. I'm, I already have a Raspberry Pi. Okay. So what do you got to do? 
all you got to do is comment down below and say, give me the A box pie. And then today is February 1st. I'll let this roll for two weeks. So let's say I'm going to go a little more than two weeks. I'm going to go to a, a, a special anniversary for me, which is February 18th be the one year anniversary of my dad's death so in honor of my dad on February 18th we will randomly draw the winner of this super pie setup provided by a box sound good but wait there's more I'm not gonna let you go with just this because you still need a couple more things so how about I throw in a five inch HDMI touchscreen display 800 by 480 HDMI touchscreen very nice very nice nice indeed yes 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 is that good enough you want more all right one more thing how about the Pi supply and USB hub this is a pretty cool little device here what you've got is a 4,000 milliamp hour 3.7 volt LiPo battery, charge protection on board. It gives you one, two, three, four, five USB ports, data port, charge port, power switch, LEDs, and your Pi will mount right to the top of it. So that's it. I want to thank ABOX for sending this out. I believe this is a fantastic kit. If you're just getting started in Raspberry Pi, definitely check this out. I'll put a link to the ABOX kit down below. And like I said, if you guys want this, enter by February 18th and say, give me the ABOX Pi, and it could be yours. One caveat. If you're inside the United States, I'll cover the shipping. I'll even cover the shipping to Canada even all the way up there to Moose Knuckle, Dennis. If you're outside the United States or Canada, you gotta pay the shipping. Alright? Fair enough? Okay. Now get out of here and go do something useful. I'll see you next time. Peace.